Hey friends! So I'm on week 30 of Weight Watchers and taking my Thrive and another good week. I'm down 3.4 pounds I think it was. I'm at 169.1 so or no 169.5 I'm, I'm sorry um, yesterday I was 170.4 and then this morning I woke up and I was under 170. So I am super excited. Um, that was my next big goal was to get under 170 because the last time I was under 170 healthy wise, like fit, like taking good care of myself. It was in 2011. Um, 2016, I was in the 160s, I think, like 170s, but it was because I was badly addicted to drugs and I got myself in a terrible situation. And those, that weight loss was because of that. So I don't even include that. Um, cause I, when I got clean, I gained that weight back quick. <laughs> Um, but these last 30 weeks, I have worked very hard. I've been determined, consistent, and very focused. And I, I just, I feel like my life has gotten so much better. And I have such a, an appreciation for my body more than I ever have. Like, I genuinely care about my well-being, not just physically, but mentally. And my confidence is through the roof. Um, I love sharing my my story, my testimony, my experience. Um, anytime somebody reaches out and asks me, you know, for help, I love to be able to help in any way that I can with what I've learned. You know, I know everybody's path is different. Everybody's story is different. Um, I don't like when people try to tell you how you're doing it wrong or that walking isn't enough because I'm living proof that it, it can be. At least it has been for me. Um, I've taken uh, more serious strides now in my fitness because I want to be stronger. Not because I need to, because walking is plenty to lose weight. But I want to be strong. I want to be more toned. So I joined the gym over about a month and a half ago. That's where I'm actually in the parking lot about to go in. Um, and I've been doing more uh, like three sets of 15 of whatever it is I'm doing. Yesterday I worked on my arms. Um, today I'm going to work a little bit on my legs. And I'm going to do a minimum of 30 minutes um, cardio. So I'm really excited. I'm pumped up about the fact that I am down now 68.1 pounds. So I am like 19 pounds away from my goal, give or take. I don't really know what my goal is. Um, but at first it was 150. But I think somewhere between 150 and 147. Somewhere in that range, that's where I'm going to be. Um, at least that's where I think. I don't want to be any less than that because I know like right now to look at me, you would think, okay, so you don't really need to lose a lot more weight unless you saw me in a bikini. You'd be like, okay, maybe in your belly, <laughs> but that's how I feel. All my weight that I have left now is in my stomach that I need to get rid of. Uh, four minutes. I've been running my mouth. Okay. Before I go any further, I want to say, Hey, Deb. Hey, Lindsay. Hey, my honey, Kevin. Um, Hi, um, if anybody else is watching from my Better Together group, Julie, Alicia, Nikki, Amy, um, I hope you all are doing great. Um, I'm excited for all of you and your journeys, and I'm excited. I'm very proud of you, Lindsay, for the weight loss that you have um, had so far, and Nikki, you've been sharing your progress. I'm so proud of you, and um, I don't know. I'm pumped to see this year and what it has in store for all of us. And anybody else that's watching, watching, welcome. Please subscribe and like this video um, just to show me that uh, you're enjoying it. And I'll share more about, you know, if there's anything that you want to know more about, please let me know and I'll share it in my, my following videos. 
Um, I do this for accountability. I make these videos every week so that when I'm having a rough time, I can go back and look and see the progress that I've made and the weeks that I was struggling, why I was struggling. The last two weeks, I've worked harder on keeping my heart rate above like in the 120s for a more consistent amount of time and not eating after 6 30 p.m um i've also found out that sprite zero was hurting my stomach i cut that out and i'm no longer having any stomach pains um and now i just basically drink water but that's i enjoy that um and I've noticed a major change in the way I feel and my weight loss since then. And I've been talking to my husband about how, you know, I don't push people to learn about like how well thrive the vitamins, these, the capsules, this and the shake work for me because I don't want people to feel like, oh, she's just trying to sell something. Honestly, I don't care who you get it from. You ain't got to talk to me about it and get it through me. I'm telling you, it works for me and many other people. Um, when I went three weeks without it, I couldn't figure out what was wrong. I'm like, why am I always so tired when I wake up? And why is it when I work out, I'm tired after just a couple of minutes. And then I realized I'm like, oh my gosh, I've not been taking my Thrive. I, I had stopped taking it because I felt like maybe it's not doing anything and it's all in my head. But then I realized, no, it's not. So I started taking it again. Now, not only the mornings are my best time, which never in the past were they, um, when I work out, I have more energy and I can last a lot longer with my, my workout regimens. I, I can keep, like, I can go strong. Um, it is not a miracle cure-all, but it is amazing how it fills in the gaps of what I'm missing in my life with what I eat and anything that my body is missing, it fills in those gaps. 100%. I believe that with my entire being that I am where I'm at today because of taking Thrive. And that is not me trying to sell something to anybody. That's me being real. That this journey, I would not be where I'm at with my weight loss and my energy and the way I feel the clarity if it wasn't for taking my Thrive. So... I had to, I have to put that in there because I don't feel like I ever give enough credit to um, how much of an impact it has had on my weight loss journey. Okay, you guys have a great day. I turned my car off seven minutes and 48 seconds ago and it is like 80 degrees outside plus and it's getting hotter and hotter and hotter because I turned my car off for some stinking reason. I thought y'all could hear me better. But anyways, you guys have a great week. I'm excited. I'm motivated. I'm in the 160s now from 237 to 169. Yeah, I'll take it. All right. You guys have a great day. Bye.